Well, welcome back. I am here with Chaplain Dennis Trujillo, and he brought Chloe Hart, and they are both from Through God Comes Justice Ministries. And, well, I guess, Dennis, why don't we talk about first, what is this whole ministry? Through God Comes Justice Ministry is the um, jail ministry in the Tom Green County Jail. We've been around since 1997. And one of the programs that we do is uh, Christmas Hope every year. And um, we try to provide gifts for all the inmates' children that are 12 and under. We've been doing this for several years. And the reason for that is um, we don't want to make the uh, children suffer because their parents are incarcerated. Mm -hmm. So we try to bring some Christmas cheer and uh, this year alone, we've had almost 500 gifts to deliver, so it's uh, a pretty good turnout, and they go all throughout the United States. We have uh, a lot right here in San Angelo, but also throughout Texas and throughout the United States. It just depends on where their children are located. And you have volunteers that do this for you guys? We have volunteers that um, work all through the year. They uh, collect money from donations. They put these boxes together when the sheets come through with um, uh, from the inmates. Uh, they start filling those boxes. And then we have other volunteers that come and deliver those boxes. So it's just like a group process and, yes. to make this happen. And, yeah. it, it takes a while. Um, we're doing uh, deliveries all this week. Okay. Um, we hope to get them all out by the weekend so that these children can have these gifts before Christmas. Hmm. But you collect money all year round. We collect money all year long. Uh, if people would like to donate, they can um, contact the jail ministry office at the sheriff's office or call our number at 486-0868. Okay. And Chloe, you were actually one of the recipients, am I correct? Yes, I was. It, it was you and your sister? Yes. Okay. Well, Chloe, tell me a little bit how it was when you first got your gift. Mm -hmm. I, it made me feel special because it made me realize that, she, that someone does care about me, and it was just it was a nice feeling to get a present from them. What did you get, if you don't mind me asking? I got a blanket and... Um, I think I got some clothes or yes. Nice. Mm -hmm. And what did your sister get? She got toys. Oh nice. Oh, yes. So, um, I know your sister is not here mm -hmm. to tell us how it felt, but she was pretty excited about it, wasn't yeah, she? She was really excited. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So how old were you in it? How I was it? eight. You were eight? Yes. Okay. Well, and like you said, it was anyone under twelve. That's right. Okay. And how many kids do you guys reach in total, you think? Um, nearly five hundred. Uh, gifts go out. We put some in the mail. We hand deliver everything that's local. So it takes us pretty much the whole week to do that. And last year we started uh, delivering food boxes as well. Because as we went to these different houses, we noticed that a lot of times it was grandparents that were raising these kids. Um, and they did not have a whole lot. So we thought if we could give them a box of food to help uh, with the Thanksgiving meal or, you know, the rest of the week while the kids are off uh, school, uh, we would be able to do that as well. Do you have any personal stories that you would like to share when delivering? Yes, actually, um, I've been doing this for years. Um, but it's always fun to go out and a, a lot of times I will take, um, I have three girls myself and I will take them with me to do the deliveries and just to be able to see the excitement on their faces to deliver these kids to the, or uh, gifts to the kids. Um, one, one year uh, I took probably eight boxes to this one house and this uh, grandmother came to the door and all the kids were running around and um, before I left the kids said wait I have something for you so um, I waited there on the porch and they ran around to the back they climbed up the tree and grabbed some mistletoe and brought that to me they wanted to make sure that I didn't leave without a gift as well so. oh that is so sweet well hey thank you both for coming on I really appreciate it and yeah so sweet anyways thank you so much and don't go anywhere we'll be right back